What's up? My name is Joe and this is my 2017 WRX. Okay, so the story behind this car is originally in January, I bought a 2016 WRX CVT. I owned it for about a month. Shortly after getting an access port, I realized that the transmission can't handle um, a lot of mods. So I traded it in in February for a 2017 base model WRX. I did the 2018 front bumper conversion. Unfortunately, I did it before Subi Speed offered it. So uh, that cost me a little extra money out of pocket. Uh, I just had this Sieben hood installed or Saibon, however the hell you say it. I just got a wrap from Christine Parts out in Fremont, California. This is Satin Thundercloud by 3M. Um, I also have the JDM fog bezels and full STI lip kit painted gloss black. And I just recently purchased this Prova R racing wing by Dam Performance in Japan. Um, I haven't seen a lot of people rock this wing or anybody, so you know, gotta try to be unique as possible. Subi Speed tail lights, um, and that's about it. First mod, one of the very first mods I did, had to go raise Volk Racing wheels, ZE40. They're 18 by nine and a half plus 38 offset, and uh, with the kicks, two-piece lugs. I absolutely loved the mag blue when I saw it, had to get it, and I don't think I'll be changing wheel colors anytime soon, so. I wish I bought an STI looking back, but I thought this was just going to be a daily driver and now it's not even close to that. Um, so if you do plan on tracking or modding, get an STI, but I got these Brembo brakes off a 2007 STI, had them rebuilt and powder, powder coated at RMS wheels um, out in Fremont, California. I have DBA 4000 rotors and uh, Carbotech brake pads. and. STI stainless steel line. Suspension, I have uh, HKS Hypermax GT coilovers. I also got race comp engineering front and rear sway bars, which is by far the 
most favorite mod I have. They're 25.5 millimeters front and back with Carboy end links and it completely changed how the car handles and feels. I can kick the rear end out if I accelerate into a turn now. It pretty much eliminated any kind of understeer issues I've had. Okay, so all my performance mods are Grim Speed, uh, top mount intercooler, charge pipe, intake, uh, EGR TGV deletes. Uh, I have a Grim Speed ceramic coated catted downpipe that's mated to a NVIDIA full titanium single exit exhaust. Also, a, one of my first performance mods before I even threw an access port on was the IAG AOS, which I highly recommend to anybody who plans on modding their car or even keeping it stock. I think that's one of the best mods you can go with. Another word of advice, if you're gonna go full bolt-ons, do the flex fuel at the same time so you don't have to spend money on a tune twice. Get it done all at once if you can. Uh, this runs on an E60 blend. Uh, tuned by Travis at Snail Performance, who's now at M45 Automotive. Highly recommend seeing him. Um, he's very helpful and knowledgeable, but flex fuel, as everybody says, completely changes uh, the way the car feels, the way it sounds. Um, I went from 304 wheel horsepower to 356 wheel horsepower, 354 wheel torque on E60, and that's a conservative tune. Um, very happy with it. As far as interior mods go, I got uh, Brom bucket seats, reclinable, very happy with them. Awesome if you want to daily it or track it. I went to Autocross at Sonoma Raceway and they held me in place really well. Um, and my favorite interior mod of all is ripping these back seats out so I don't have to give people rides and weight savings. So that's what's up. Okay, so JDM, trim carbon fiber trim just little interior pieces to clean it up a little bit because the oem stuff is a little cheesy so okay so that was just a quick overview of my car obviously there's more things to come one thing being an oil cooler i'm trying to get this ready for track season come next year um, if you want to follow the build, I would appreciate it. Uh, my Instagram is at Subi Strong. Thanks. Just want to add to ever since I bought this Subaru and got into the Subi community, I've met nothing but cool people um, and I've really enjoyed meeting like minded people who enjoy Subarus.